hello guys welcome back to another video today is madame glam's ninth anniversary so yeah they are nine years today so happy anniversary to madame glam i want to do a little sign for to like celebrate you know their anniversary day um we'll find my code i have a 30 percent off code uh, which you see on screen and find links and all of that in down in my description box so i'm just gonna start applying one or two coats with the perfect white using the perfect white from madame glam and then we're gonna do some marble got two thin coats of perfect white on and i'm gonna try and see these colors i might use a bit of this this is a reflective gel polish called fancy pants I might try some of this. I'm going to do kind of a different thing today. Very simple. Um, so it's a pink called Pink Madness. Um, the purple is called Eternal Bliss. These two are pretty new. This one is an old one called Rooftop Party. Um, so I'm going to... Let's see. Instead of, you know, using the brush and all that stuff for marbling... We're going to try, let's take some of this to get a little bit of sparkle. So it's just going to be a simple set. So we're going to just blob some color on here and there. Of the different colors. I don't know how much I need. We're going to try and see. Um, oops, oops, oops. The only thing is, you know, not putting the brush into the different or the, yeah, the gel polish brush in the other colors. So it just, I think there will be way too little green on here. Before I've used, you know, um, the brush and kind of made like a, just dragged it down. Now I want to try something else, so let's add some of this and see how it, oh my goodness, can you see how it turns out? I have no clue, that's a way too little green on here, way too little green. Yeah, let's see, it. let's try and add some more, um, I think it's going to be messy. <laughs> okay, let's try, I put this on because I don't want it all over my gloves, so I'm just going to start dabbing my finger you know to kind of marvel this around either you get too little green or too much i guess it looks more like a messy mess that's okay i forgot the white i was supposed to have white in here yeah <laughs> i was supposed to have white in here can i do that now oh my goodness i don't know let me wipe off that finger let's see if i can add a little bit of the perfect white just the tiniest little bit gosh i'm a mess just some tiny small tiny small little blobs oh my goodness <gasps> that was not easy i'm like easy it is easy but i don't want it to be like looking totally crazy and could add some more glitter on it. Look at that, that is actually kind of a cool effect. Um, so it will be pretty thick, um, you know, when you do it like this. So you can keep, uh, keep yeah, dabbing on. I did not use any grooming gel, you know, no wet gel under this. So I will try and, um, Bleed out a bit on the sides if there is, you know, too much that is kind of oozing out on the sides, but there is actually not much on the sides at all. So we're just going to pop this into the lamp and we're going to keep doing this on all. I'm going to give that a double cure, by the way. I'm going to keep doing that on all the nails and see how they all turn out, okay? Oh, oh, oh. 
So I've cured them for 60 seconds. They are cured good. I'm going to go in with Philippines, you know, my favorite rubber base coat. And because these are, it is a pretty thick coat of gel. So we're going to go over this one to kind of smooth the nail out a bit. And if you have to just go over with a buffer. I'm going to do a good coat of this and then I'm going to do just a little bit of stamping on one nail. It is very fast and simple set, but at the same time it's kind of cool. It got a bit wishy-washy, <laughs> some of them, because like the last one was best. This one got most like, you know the most color of them the other ones got a little bit I pressed you know I was messing too much pressing too many times and going over and over um, so don't do that just you know get it mixed and stuff doing a good layer of this and then I'm going to turn it upside down and let it um, like level to the top of the nail right so just a good amount you can also do two coats or several coats so turn it over let it dry down to the middle and then cure it for 30 seconds so i have buffed them and wiped off the um just I have the Moutine 022 plate here and I'm just gonna stamp this nine number nine on one of the nails since it's their ninth anniversary I'm using my she modern white sticky stamping polish so let's do that do it off there we go Gel on the side. Let me just remove that just so we don't get it on the nail and get extra stuff to clean off. Let's see. I'm trying to see this. You can see what I'm doing. I think I need to leave it white. You know, if not, it's going to be. I think I could chrome it, but I am afraid it will not, you know, show up very good if I do that. Um, so I think we're going to leave it as it is with the white. So I'm just going to let this dry and then we will do the top coat. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go over with the no wipe top coat from Madame Guam. And then I'm going to just put some cuticle cuffs on top of the nails with these. I cannot think the color is called, but it's like a pinky purple and some caviar beads. So I'll show you one nail and then we will I will do the rest of camera. Here is the finished product, guys. So, happy anniversary to Madame Glam. As always, I love using that product. As I said, just don't do as I did, you know. Keep pressing a lot. Be aware of how much you're dabbing your finger on because you're mixing it. The more you're dabbing, the more you're mixing it. But that's it for today. 
remember my code if you want to save 30% of your order. So thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.